This car is special to me because I, I love movies. So I saw the car in the movies and uh, also it was driven by some of the people that I admire, Grace Kelly, Nina Simone. And of course, um, I associate the car with Monaco every time I see it. So it's just one of the cars that I said, if I can put my hands around this car, I'll be the happiest woman. I just love the way it's got the aura around it. You know, it's, it's adorable, it's got beautiful curves, beautiful lines, um, and you can't be fast, you know. It's very graceful, and this is what I love about this car. Of course, the color. I mean, the color is just stunning, and it's a unique car. I mean, if you see it, you just fall in love with this car. When I saw this car about four years ago, in fact, I was traveling with him. I'm the guy who cleans the car and makes sure it's nice and safe. And we saw the car, and it was like, hmm, am I really going to put my hands around this car? And then he said to me, you know what? If you put your mind to it, you can have anything that you want. And I was very clear that this is the car that I really would like to have. And the rest was history. The first time, of course, is scary because the only thing you think about is there is no way I can smash this car. You know, it's a difficult car to drive. You know, I'm used to easy cars, you know, power steering wheel and lots of mirrors, etc. But here yeah, you've got to be very attentive and you've got to choose the back routes, of course. So um, it's very challenging to drive this car. And also, if you don't have time, you can't drive this car because it demands your patience. You must have the heart, you know, because like he says, it can disappoint you. But you can't now say, oh, it means I can never drive this car. Um, many a time we've had to you know, step aside, uh, call a mechanic, and then, uh, and then you continue driving. And, and that's the fun of, of vintage cars. most memorable trip with this car is when we decided to participate in the first um, SA Conco. The car was um, transported to, to Houting on a flatbed. Then from there, we drove to Sun City. And of course, it was a whole lot of us. You know, there was a car in front, there was a car at the back, and I would drive, he would drive, and, um, and we kept asking ourselves, what on earth, why did we join this? This is so hard. What if it came back with nothing? And then you said, oh, well, it's an experience. Of course, when you got there, it was a beautiful bus, beautiful cars, exciting. And of course, you know, when you transport a car, you've got to take out fuel. Halfway there, the car went dum, 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 dum. and the rule was you must drive the car right to the spot to otherwise you can't yeah. participate it <laughs> wow and then we said no man these guys when they took it off the trailer they did not put enough fuel they just didn't refuel the car oh and, and of course one <laughs> 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 <won. laughs> And of course, you get many offers. Oh, all the time. I mean, the minute you get, you know, you drive this car, everybody wants to buy this car for <laughs> you. That's <laughs> so you can imagine if you've got, you've got to name your price, <laughs> you know, that's we are always at the best advantage. But, um, you know, there's no way I can sell this car. I mean, it's my dream car.
Hello and welcome to the end of the video. There is so much cool stuff to do here. Well, I mean, you can just click on stuff, but that's, that's pretty cool, right? 